This is a pretty nice wall. And this is the Great Wall of China. 1,500 years, multiple dynasties, and a whole lot of sticky rice. They, the scientists, estimate that the total cost was over $400 billion in today's money, making it one of the most expensive things ever built by humans. And here are a few more. Did you know astronauts can't burp in space? Well, I wouldn't either if it wasn't for this 28-year-old metal tube. The ISS, an engineering marvel, a symbol of international collaboration, and an indication of just how far Pizza Hut will go to give a man what he rightfully deserves. A, a day-old greasy pie. The total cost to build the ISS was $150 billion, which is more than every building on the Las Vegas Strip combined. What are the odds of that? A little casino joke? Okay. The Roman Empire left behind many things, like the Latin alphabet, taxation systems, and lead pipes that chronically poisoned people for generations. But their most impressive creation was the 250,000 mile long Roman road network. This is honestly very impressive considering that they pretty much only used shovels and donkeys. They didn't have fancy multi-tools or bulldozers with cruise control. Nope, just raw, unrelenting stoicism. It only took about $150 billion, 800 years, and a whole lot of slave labor to create the phrase, all roads lead to Rome. Unless you're in the Americas, or Australia, or pretty much like any other island. Before we had self-driving cars, cell phones, or memory foam pillows, we had space rockets. We put a man on the moon, not because it was easy, but because it was hard. Why, Why does Rice play, play Texas? Texas? The Apollo program lasted a whole 12 years until people were like, shut up about the moon, shut up about the moon. And so NASA parked all their rockets and called it a day. The Apollo program had a total cost of $25 billion and adjusted for inflation would be about $250 billion today. It's crazy how many things we wouldn't have without the Apollo program. Cordless power tools, smoke detectors, portable water filters, freeze-dried food, anti-scratch resistant coating on glasses, Stanley cups. Where would we be without Stanley cups, huh? Are you a train nut, a rail junkie? Do you love the sound of a good choo-choo? Well, so does China. The Chinese high-speed rail network is over 45,000 kilometers, which is bigger than the rest of the world's railways combined. Now that's loco. Motive. Their trains get up to 270 miles per hour, while the US is over here like, no, I don't think this one's big enough for you. How about this one here? You're really gonna love the massaging seats. The current cost is sitting at $500 billion, and they're still going. They plan to add another 25,000 kilometers over the next 10 years. You could say they're trained to build more. Get it? Because trains? And the most expensive thing ever built is the F-35 fighter jet, which has a life cycle cost of $1.7 trillion. This makes some people ask, is this a good decision to spend taxpayer money on a little plane? Uh, yeah, look at this thing. It's like a flying Lamborghini. Is it a plane? Is it a helicopter? No, it's a f***ing F-35 and it belongs in a Michael Bay Transformers movie. All right, I'm just joking around here, relax. That is a lot of money, but that is the total cost for the life cycle of the entire fleet. This was the most expensive project in human history. But if you were to look at one single thing, the most expensive thing ever built by humans has to be the US interstate system. This ginormous and sometimes weirdly frustrating network of roads, I mean, what? Just make a highway, dude. Originally proposed in 1956 as a 12-year, $25 billion project, ended up taking over 30 years to complete with a total cost of $114 billion, which is about $600 billion adjusted for inflation. But if you were to rebuild it today with modern labor laws and regulations, it would cost over $2 trillion, which honestly makes sense. Did you know the guys that hold stop signs make up to $50 an hour? I know some of you are like, but what about the period? Pyramids. All right, first of all, we didn't build the pyramids, they flew here. And second, they would only cost like $10 billion to build today, which is way less than that little spaceship I was talking about earlier. So they wouldn't even make the list. If you like what you saw, like and subscribe. 
Thank you. The rat goes like this, like this, like this. You are now a normal rat.